Okay, so I'm required to give you guys a midterm by the end of this week. Like Thursday? Yeah, but I'm gonna take it real easy on you guys. I'm giving you a take home midterm. And it's gonna be easy. So we first, the midterm's gonna just be on the major scales. So remember the three steps? What's the step one? Alphabetical order, right? Okay, step two. Formula. Formula, right. And step three. Sharps and flats, right? Analyze for sharps and flats. Right, Donovan? Yes. Okay, so as long as you guys stick to this formula, this whole three-step plan, you'll never you'll never go wrong on the major scales. Okay, you can also do minor scales this way too, but the formula is different. Okay. All right. So now, here's how we're going to do this. We start here. start with G. So what do we do? First step. Scale. We write out the notes like this. G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, right? And then down here, G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Now, you should know the treble and bass club well enough by now. Are everybody, everybody comfortable with those? Okay. Yeah. So then after that, what do we do? What's step two, Ozzy? Formula. So we put the little formula in. Step three is we analyze them for sharps and flats, right? So what's what's the uh, formula here? G to A? K to B? B to C? So that's good. C to D? D to E? E to F? That's supposed to be a whole step, right? So then what? F sharp, right? How many are you going to give us? All of them. Oh. All 15 scales. So this is how you do that one. Now the next thing is there's going to be a keyboard diagram above it. So we start with G. We just do the G A B C D E. We put our F sharp right here, and then we have another G right there. So we fill out the keyboard diagram. So it gets you guys to know how to play the keyboards. Okay, so we're going to start doing these in class, and these are due on Thursday. I have to turn in a midterm grade for everybody according to their dean of students and everybody. So 
You guys will do well in this. I know you got the major skills in. Wait, the judgment is Thursday? Thursday. I'm um, letting you know in advance. This is the take home midterm, and we're going to start it in class right now. Okay? So, you got two days. This takes about one hour to do this whole thing. You can't get this I don't have an hour. No, I have to turn them in the end of the week. I have to do everything by the end of the week. There's the rules and regulations. You got the major skills. So let's start doing these. I mean, this is college. This is a class. You just got to do the work. Nobody's been showing up very much, so this is how you gauge your performance in the class, you know. We start here. would be to write the letter names on the keyboard right don't do that because that'll mess you up start with writing the notes on the treble clef okay so Ozzy why don't you come up and try to do A scale in alphabetical order, right? So you don't even have to know the names of those, you just go space line, space line, space line, space line, right? Can we go try it? Just write A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A. Eh? C 
So all the sharks on the black. Yeah, black ones too. Are we doing okay? When we do the formula and put it in your right. You can do the formula in your head if you want. So we don't put it right in. The whole trick is you want to get all the sharps and quads and then write them on the keyboard. Okay. The whole point is you're going to have a notebook full of this stuff where you've got the key. Yeah, see, he's learning how to play it, see? It's all about the sound of it rather than just the logic of it. So this would be F player? There's B. That's C, C sharp to E, F, F sharp, G, G sharp, A. That's why we're doing this. So you know the key. Okay. G sharp, A. Okay. 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 Well, we did G. Flip through that looking one that looks really hard. Let's go for it in class. B. B, good. So, first things first, alphabetical order, right? Mm -hmm. So, B could be right here, right? Yeah. And it can also be right there, right? And it can also be right here, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, I get it. <laughs> right? Good boys do $20. Okay, so come on up here and fill it out. Learn by doing. Just write the scale without sharps or flats. Just note line space, line space, line space. Okay. Line space, line space. Is okay. this good enough, or do you want to, like, do you want me to write in A, but it's like G, A, B? On the you got to put a sharp there. Like a sharp. Yeah, but other than that, is that fine? That's perfect. That. Don't forget your name though. Yeah. Okay, I'll try from here. Line space, that's all you gotta do. That's line and space, line. See how easy it is? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's more notes. Line, space, line, space, line, space. Now ledger line, right? One ledger line. And then this ledger line space. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yeah. So that's the B in alphabetical order, right? So if you want to help yourself, I would just do this really real quick. B, C, D, E, F, G, A, B. Just write them in on there on somewhere. Okay, now go ahead. Okay, half steps and whole step formula with analysis. Want to try to sharpen sharp and flat go before the yeah. note or out? In English, right, we say F sharp, right? So the letter name goes to the left of the sharp. No, but before, like on notes, though. On notes, it's your sight reading, and so you sharp the note as you read it. So before F. Before. Okay, Kim, you come on up and put the formula in, and then 
try, try doing the sharps and flats. Formulas you can do in your head if you don't if you don't want to write them in. It's not necessary. The whole point of my drilling is to so you. But for this, like, do we have to write them in, or how does that? No. What I'm looking for is just the scale written out with all the correct sharps and flats in it, and then write it on the keyboard. Yeah. See, you got a keyboard to try it on. So much easier. See, that's the whole idea is you try it on the piano if you can find one, you know. See? Okay. Now, yeah, go ahead and analyze. Red, perfect. So, not, not, not until you get this one done. Do the keyboard last, that way it's much easier. So see, sharp right in front, front of the Good. C sharp two Y. D sharp. Absolutely. A B flat. A B flat. Yeah, we'll get this one written down. Copy it. Okay. <laughs> there is. In the key of E, there is a G sharp. Yeah. scales is you gotta understand all the chords come from all the scales. So when you have a major scale, you can pick chords out of that scale. And that's how you write songs. That's why it's so important to learn all these because it keeps you in in sounding in, in key.
Okay, so P was B flat. Okay, so step one. Alphabetical. Alphabetical order. So if you don't know the notes that good on the bass or treble clef, just write the English equivalent. So B flat, alphabetical only. I'm not worried about sharps or flats, right? C, V, E, F, G, A, B e flat on both ends, right? B flat here, so this one has to be B flat, right? Okay, then we write it on the staff. E flat, C, D, E, F, G, A, B flat. And then down here, B flat, C, D, E, F, G, A, and then B flat, right? Okay. Now, Donovan, can you come up with the formula? Wait, in your honor, we're going to use orange. So, I like to go like this, right? This is my technique, so I know it's checked off. All right? <laughs> C to D, is that a whole step? Yes. Okay. Now, D to E, is that a half step? No, it's not. We have to make it a half step. How do we do that? Why don't I, why don't I just do this D sharp here? Because well, that, that, we can't mix sharps and flats, can we? No. And that screws this round. C, C to D sharp is not a whole step anymore. That's a step and a half, isn't it? So you can't use D sharp, right? Yes. So what do I have to do? E flat. Ozzy? Huh? What do I have to do to make that a half step? Yeah, it to E flat. E flat, right? Now, we want a whole step between E and E flat and F, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah? So E flat to F is a whole step, isn't it? Yes. And F to G, is that a whole step? Mm -hmm. G to A, is that a whole step? Yeah? Yes. And then A to B flat, is that a half step? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now, Camille, can you come up and write it on the keyboard? You're on a ring screen. Because you're wearing green. So we start on B flat. So, I have a right? Question. Okay. I'll go for uh, this. Um, you only change it down here. Like we only look at this one. When you say this is a full step, this is a half step. We only change the bottom one. What? I'm not sure what you mean. Because okay, like for the treble clef line, yeah. you don't change anything. But when you come down here, you change it here. Is that just because? Change both of them. I didn't write the flat sound on the notes. That's my mistake. I don't get it. It's the same thing. I just wrote it on the bottom. They were two of both. Oh, e flat, C, B, E flat. Perfect. So we want an E flat here. Oh. Yeah. We want an E flat there. Put them both on there. Does that answer your question? Yeah. Okay. So how? There's some hard keys in the, in the, at the end. Like what do we got? We got G flat. D flat. Can we do sharps? Yeah. How about F sharp? Okay. That's a hard key, huh? Yes. How do we do F sharp? You do alphabetical. You guys hate hate yeah. this drill, but you're gonna love it in five five <laughs> years from now. You're never gonna forget how to do scales. <laughs> never. <laughs> you, you'll you'll pass all your classes later. On. I'm gonna try and figure it. Okay. So this scale here is B flat. Now do you see how you play it on the piano? Yeah. yeah. So if you have a piano around, try it on the piano.
key are we doing? F sharp? Yes. Okay. It's time for purple. It's time for purple. It's time for purple, isn't it? Okay. So F sharp, here's F, right? And here's F. Well, G, is it F down here? There's F here, right? Mm -hmm. So if we write high up here, we're going to run into some ledger lines, aren't we? On the base clip, right? Probably. Okay, so here's F here. So what's the training wheels thing to do? Write it in English first, right? What? The, the, the cheap trick training wheels way to do it is just go like this. F, G, A, B, C, D, E, F first, right? Yes. In English. That's F sharp, so we want to make that F sharp, right? So we put it F sharp here. You have to make that Both one. Both the center. You don't forget, you got to do this one too, because it's the same note, right? Yes. Okay. Now, the notes on the staff. Ozzy, are you with me? Okay. So we're going to put the notes in G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, right? And then down here we got F sharp, G, oops, G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp. See all those ledger lines? Okay. Now, since it's later on in the in the pamphlet, it's gonna be a lot of sharps. So get ready. Okay. So now Ozzy, come on up here and put the whole steps and half steps in, please. That's how you learn it. Get magic orange here. Just put a whole step, whole step, whole step. Make sure you know the formula. Now, if you guys are bored with this, that's okay because you'll learn it. And we'll go on, we're going to go on to learning more that's about hard. rhythm. Whole step, whole step, whole step. Okay, good. Now, let's analyze it. Everybody can analyze it. First one F sharp to G. What's that? Look on your number line. What is it? Half step. Half step. So it has to be a whole step, right? Yeah. So we got to make a G sharp, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Put a sharp here and then a sharp here, sharp. here, and then a sharp here, right? Yes. G sharp to A. What's that? That's a half step, isn't it? Look on your number line. That's a half step. So it's got to be a sharp, right? Yes. Yeah. Question? Do we have a question? No. A sharp to B, that's, that's a half step, isn't it? So we're good, right? C sharp. Now, B to C is a half step, so it has to be a whole step, doesn't it? So what are you going to do? C sharp. C sharp. <laughs> <laughs> now, C sharp to D, that's a half step, isn't it? Yeah. So we have to make it a whole step, right? Mm -hmm. So make it D sharp, right? Mm -hmm. D sharp to E, that's a half step, isn't it? So we got to make that the weird one, E sharp, right? Yeah. <coughs> and that works because we have an F sharp already. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Okay, now, you, you want to come up and put these on the keyboard or you don't feel comfortable? No? Okay, let me try. Okay, first you got to find F sharp. So here's C, D, E. Here's F sharp, starts off, here's F sharp right here. Um, so then you want, here's C, D, E, F, G, D sharp, all right? Then you want A sharp, uh, and B, that's okay. C, that's C. How do you know? There's B. <laughs> B, we want a C sharp, <laughs> we want a D sharp, <coughs> now, wait, wait, wait. Well, that's right, B, C sharp, D sharp, here's E, so what's E sharp? Here. This one here, that's what? F. Wait, oh, so that's it goes F. here? Yeah. That's actually the key of F, that's actually, here's the notes. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A. 
Leave that up. There's F right there, right? And E sharp is F, right? But we can get away with that because the sharp then. Right there. Same as this one. Okay, does every everybody kind of get a grip on how to do this? Okay. Yep. And this is due to I gotta collect them on Thursday. You got a lot of homework piled up between, between now and then, between other classes? Tons. Too much? Yeah. Probably. So if we if I come late, I'm sorry. <laughs> on Thursday. What how much homework do you have? Just like dozens of hours of stuff to do? Well I mean, I'm sure some of us work too. Um, yeah. Maybe just me. All right. Well, they, they want everything, they want to, I have to turn in midterm reports by this week. That's fine, but I might just be late. Just turn in what you got, you know, okay. gotta get them all in. I, I want everybody to understand how to do scales because we're gonna, after scales we got chords and melodies, you know, that's how you play music. All the scale stuff is the basis of music. That's why we're doing scales. Okay. Everybody think they can get it done by Thursday? Okay. All right. Thanks for coming tonight, everybody. Yay. Anybody got any homework to turn in? Class notes or any of that stuff? Turn that all in on Thursday. Okay. I just need to finish this. Okay. But I turned in my notes. Yeah, you did. <laughs> How you doing on that, Dollar? Can I just, like, <laughs> get burn? it Burn. Can I burn a CD of like all of your videos and just give it to you for class notes? I know they're on my notes. <laughs> these are my notes. <laughs> the same on paper. Mm. Okay, this is your official midterm, so try to get it done, please. It'll be done. And then I think I'll give you guys a. I don't. I'm supposed to give a, a final exam in class. That's later though, right? Yeah. I'm trying to help you guys out. Don't be so for what? What? You'll do fine. I'm not good, yeah. I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna get it. Bye. I'm scared. I'm scared. Why? I'm probably going to miss like half a class on Thursday. <laughs> Look, if you, if you don't get it I'll done. Fin no, I'll finish it, but I'm saying I won't be here all the class because I want to finish it. Because I work, so that's why. I'm kind of tripping out. But, I mean, I'll still like make, like finish it, but I just Here's what you do. Do all the ones that you know first. Wow. Do all the ones that come yeah, to you quickly. I barely know any of it. <laughs> I'm like struggling. <laughs> half steps and whole steps. I think just the whole the B double flat kind of confused me.